Well, I value most about OER is the fact that I can individualize and personalize instruction. It can become engaging. It's not a one-size-fits-all. So if a teacher is not, um, it's not meeting the needs of somebody, one of their students, they can go out and they, either the student can go find something or the teacher can find something and it individualizes. I really value the potential OER has to provide equity of access to all students, um, the ability to really shift costs from the purchase of content to other areas that support learning and teaching and the, uh, the way that teachers can be empowered to create materials that meet the needs of their students. One of the things that I value about OER um, is the variety of things that are available. Um, so like some of our teachers have found resources that uh, will be good for differentiation. So when we think about something that we might teach in a whole class lesson um, that not all students would get on the first go around, some of the things that we're finding in the OER, OERs is that here is this resource that we can provide for that student who didn't get it in that first pass. We can provide them in a different avenue a chance to go back and do some personalized learning. And so that has been one of the things that is most valuable is that our teachers don't have to go and work on creating each of those differentiation pieces. Um, we can find some of those resources to use. One of the biggest challenges is the narrowing of the resources that are available. Um, so knowing all of the different avenues and the repositories that are out there, knowing which ones have the most relevant content or the things that you need, and then being able, the time and energy to go through that and kind of sift and figure out what it works best um, is definitely one of the pieces. So when we first started um, our OER project, we did a, a state snapshot of where those uh, barriers to implementation of OER were. And really the, the four things that kept bubbling to the surface were this, uh, this question of where do you locate resources? Not just any resources, but where do you locate those uh, full course curriculum and those really rich, meaty units? Um, how do you evaluate quality? It, uh, it's free, but is it high quality? Uh, questions about um, equity of access if you were doing a, a digital implementation. And lastly, questions about um, district policies that might not recognize OER as an option for inclusion and in adoption considerations.